Welcome to 4.1's Math Moment. Today, students examine shifts and multiplication. Our very first question we have is 50 times 7. I know 5 times 7 is 35. When I add a 0 to this, it becomes 350. So we're just kind of extending the fact out using the zeros trick to help them look for a simple, fast way to solve a multiplication problem. Again, I have 500 times 70. So I know 5 times 7 is 35. I have 1, 2, 3 zeros add those three zeros on the end, and I have 35,000. Going to our next question, we have 5,000 times 700. Again, applying the same strategies from the previous two problems, I'm going to say 5 times 7 is 35. I need to use 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 zeros. I have to cross off my zeros and count them as I'm going, to make sure that I add enough into my problem. So there was 5 here, so I'm going to add 5 down here. There's my 5. So now I have 3,500,000. This next question says Fido eats 10 pounds of food in a week. How much food will Fido eat in a year? So we know he eats 10 pounds a week. We want to know how much he's going to eat in a year. Well, the first thing fifth graders need to know is how many weeks are in a year. And there are 52 weeks in a year. So I'm going to take my 10 pounds times 52 weeks in a year. So 10 times 52. We want to know 1 times 52 is 52, adding a 0, makes it 520. For a label, I'm going to go back and I'm going to add pounds. So I know that Fido will eat 520 pounds of food in a year. If you have any questions about 4.1, see your math teacher.